Equities markets close on a negative note as NGS or shell index depreciated by 0.31% to close at 47,057.24 basis point as against uh, minus 0.16% depreciated or depreciation recorded uh, the previous day. It's yet to date return currently stand at 10.16% after rising to 10.68% last week. Market bread closed negative at Presco, less 16 gainers, as against 20 losers topped by Cotville at the end of uh, yesterday's trading session, an unimproved performance when compared with a previous outlook. Market turnover closed negative as volume moved down by 16.56% against 24.49% uh, recorded in the previous session. Guarantee Zenith Bank and Fidelity Bank were the most active stock to boost market turnover. Guarantee and Seplat topped market value lease. Julius Berger uh, leads the list of active stocks that recorded impressive volume spike at the end of yesterday's trading section. So let's bring in Mr. Ambrose Omodian, Chief Research Officer, Investor Consulting Limited. He joins us now. Thank you, Mr. Omodian, for joining us. Thanks for having me. Yes. Uh, look at the market yesterday. Um, give us the, di the dynamics of the market and the pros and, core, uh, and cons, rather. So w what do you think was responsible for these uh, latest negative trends we're seeing in the market? Actually, the market has been on a on a down trend. I would say what on a profit picking, uh, you know, trend we need to work into investors or traders looking at the market at this point. Why? Because market is the market today. It focuses lower than what it was the previous day. Means that people are not jumping into new positions that will stop, especially when those high cap stocks that always move to stop price are not the one people are positioning now. People are buying other ones that they see that they have potential for where their ID begins. Mm. But when you see market pulling back from the straight day, see the volatility has increased. That means risk associated with volatility has to go to a factor in. As an investor, don't play with your stop loss or trader, don't play with your stop loss. Why? Mm. Because as something taking its own now, those stories are going down. What you told your stop loss is you that know, you know sell up to a co What But the good thing is that if you look at the movement of activity in the market, People are doing us some stuff to better order. We saw what happened in um Nem Insurance. Nem Insurance was losing yesterday. Before the market was a turn among the top dealers. Also, the previous days, when school was down, but yesterday was up. It says that money are moving to where people say value for their investment. They say that when they expected that the earnings of this company will support a good dividend at the end of the day. That is that seeing profit taking is not what you send money to the market. But as we down, the index is letting on top of the trading gates looking at which that's not broken down. Don't forget that when you have trading in that you have 50 million, you have also 200. But now that was that market has broken down, the shortest number which is a nine or seven dominant energy is that we think that yes, there is kind of a correction. We'll tell you that most benefit correction already, but that correction will not last because I tell you before the weekend or early next week, we start seeing those big news with their words, they are giving them the action for the correction. But in terms of you know that also Faster than all the market to this level, and stay in touch. But don't be carried away with that because there are some that they will sell immediately and stay in the, the result. That means you also you have a goal or a data that will tell you what to do. Because market are value above 70, supposed are uh, $47,000 uh, mark. So, you signal, know, you see, you know, close above it marginally. But there is still that you correct today below you. But that is not some panic at all. I will tell you, these three days too bad, they are very, very small in terms of uh, the decline. But it's just because no big gap at the world is it. No apparently surprising that even a one that was still on the share side, not to be on the buy side yet again. Because that if those are looking at where they can make money or trade that for me, this is not example of money. Market correction is part and part of the market anywhere in the world. But let your investment go guide you. And your stop loss should be another guide. In Nigeria, I know that most of our investors in this market, they only know when to buy, they don't know when to sell. But with the help mm. of their stop loss, you will know that yet this stop loss will tell you that don't allow your capital to go down to be honest so that you can easily reduce the other investment. But when you allow your capital to lose 20 percent, no, to go and lose another stop is very bad for you. That means if you have the stop loss of 10 percent, no, 9 percent, 5 percent, yes, you buy this one. When you thought that you move and try to trade that, you don't have to wait. You don't need to go to that stop. But for traders, you are looking for more stock to stop. You don't need to lose more, more to the position before you sell out. Mm. 
Well, I think we should leave it there because of our time. We would have uh, looked at how the market uh, will fare for the rest of the week, but I think we need to leave it there. Thank you so much, Mr. Ambrose Amodian.